I'm wondering if you've got a goal, a health or body shape related goal that you have in mind and that you're maybe struggling to um, achieve. And it might be, maybe it's to develop a really flat stomach, maybe it's to become much leaner, perhaps it's to change your body shape, maybe it's even to run a half marathon or a marathon. Change is really, really hard to do. And there are lots of reasons for that. But I think one of the fundamental difficulties with making changes that relate to body shape and health is that they take a long time before you can achieve them. And even if you start to see a change within a week, the bottom line is it's a fair distance from you right now to achieving that goal, relatively speaking. Whereas you know, we have tasks that we need to do that we can kind of tick off our list very, very swiftly um, and that might be urgent to us and are popping up on a daily basis that, we, that need our attention. And we tend to deal with those first because those things require our attention. And for example, if I need to go shopping because there's no food in the house, if I don't, I'm going to go hungry that night. So there's a very immediate consequence of not going shopping and dealing with that urgent problem. However, our goals are important to us. That's why we have them. And so we are inclined to deal with the things that require our attention. And we struggle with those things that don't demand something in the moment. The other problem is that we struggle to see immediate benefits. So there's no consequence to me if I don't go to gym today or if I don't you know, look after my diet for a day. There's no immediate consequence. So I don't really feel the disbenefits. Whereas if I, as I say, if I don't have dinner, I don't have dinner, I'm gonna go hungry, I'm gonna feel it straight away. So my suggestion is always that you try and build some way to see or feel the benefit when you apply yourself to achieving that goal. So let's say your goal is to um, change your body shape, you get to gym, you're trying to do that three times a week or twice a week or whatever it is. In that moment that you're training, you need to try and find some sort of benefit that's going to bring you back again and again and again. Maybe it's, look, maybe when you're done, you sleep better. Maybe you feel really recharged. Um, maybe you just feel really good about yourself. But you need to buy into something that will keep you coming back. So that's my suggestion um, uh, at this point is to, is to think about important versus urgent build yourself a hook for bringing the important in regularly um, and just know that change is hard don't beat yourself up about it do what you can um, and you'll get there until next time take care